Fried amazing. So I bought these onions the other day. And they're trying to get away from me. I'm going to show you today how to save your onions. It's just gray and I. So we don't need three, six, nine, twelve onions. We might use one or two every now and again. So let's just see what KG has. Stay tuned. All right, amazings. I have cut my onions, peeled them, and got them all washed and cut each end off. And how are we going to preserve them? We're going to put them in a good old mason jar, right? And put the top on it and seal it. This might not be new for you, but it's a new hack for us. We bought we buy onions because it's cheaper to buy a bag of them and then just chop them. We use onions about two or three times a week. So why not? But with this first one, I'm just going to chop it. No particular design. Some of them will be rings, but I'll just chop so that we have pieces. And I will put them into my jar, just like so. No need to put any water or anything else on them. You just go for what you know. I'm going to chop this one in hoops so that you see there's different ways that you can do it. Be careful not to cut your hand. Right? So you have those rings. You can just drop those down in there. If they don't fit, give them a cut. Just cut them in half. Because generally that's what you're going to do when you're cooking anyway. You might put big hoops on like meat or something like that. But they'll keep any way you put them in this jar. I just do a variety so that I can just dump them out when I'm done. That's it. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six onions. When those all get cut up, I'll show you how I seal them and just put them in the fridge. Nice and simple. All right, amazing. So we ran out of space in our jar, but that's okay. We just cut hoops, and there's the other way to save them. Just in Ziploc bags. I will place the onions in this bag, just like this. Now, on the side, I have a large, like, gallon bag that I will use, and I will put this bag inside of that bag. That is to secure the odor. So I'll show you that in just a second. But you write on there your date, you don't put any water or anything in either storage container. You just let them freeze or cool naturally. They're just as crisp as they are when you put them in, I promise. So just hold on and I'll show you the double bag and that's it. All right, amazing. there you have it. We are double bagged. Double Ziploc bag, labeled on the first one, fold it over, get the air out, and just close it. This you will just lay flat in your freezer. This you can put on the shelf. And look, they're all done. No water. I promise you, they don't weep. Watch us this week, and we'll probably cook with these. That's it. Onions 101 from the KG Camp. Peace.